I want you to stay with me for the next few minutes because what I'm about to tell you has the power to completely change how you think about heart health, artery repair, and the hidden causes behind clogged blood vessels. Most people believe that artery blockage happens suddenly, that one day you're fine and the next day you're in trouble. But the truth is it doesn't happen overnight. It builds silently inside you for years without any obvious signs until the day your body finally says, I can't take it anymore. The shocking part is that most people who ended up with blocked arteries were not careless. Many of them ate what they thought were healthy meals. Some exercised regularly. Some avoided sugar and junk food. Some even followed strict diets for years. And yet, they still struggled with chest tightness, fluctuating blood pressure, numbness, dizziness, sudden fatigue, and unexplained weakness. So clearly, something was missing from the common advice people follow. After years of observation, one thing became crystal clear. Clogged arteries are not caused by just bad food. They're caused by inflammation, slow, silent, dangerous inflammation that damages the inner lining of your arteries. Once the lining is damaged, cholesterol sticks to it like glue. More inflammation means more sticking. Over time, the arteries become narrow, stiff, and unable to carry oxygen, rich blood to important organs. That's when problems start. But the most important part is that just as your arteries can get damaged, they can also repair themselves if you know what to feed your body. Your arteries are living tissues. They breathe, expand, contract, and heal. They're not rigid pipes. They're flexible tubes made of cells that repair themselves when given the right nutrients. Imagine a cracked wall that slowly repairs when you apply the right material. That's exactly how arteries heal. Soft, slow, steady, natural repair. But let me tell you a surprising truth. Most people never give their arteries the nutrients they need to repair. They take medicines that manage symptoms but do nothing for the root cause. They eat foods that fill the stomach but provide no repair molecules. They follow diets but miss the specific compounds that soften plaque and restore artery flexibility. That's why today I'm going to share three powerful artery repair foods. Simple, everyday foods that trigger your body's natural healing process. These foods reduce inflammation, boost nitric oxide, clear plaque, improve blood flow, and support the endothelial lining inside your arteries. This is not guesswork. This is supported by real research, real patients, and real healing. But before we talk about those foods, I want you to imagine something. Close your eyes and picture your arteries like long water pipes. Now imagine tiny cracks inside those pipes. Any water carrying dirt will cling to those cracks. Slowly the dirt builds layer by layer forming a blockage. That's exactly what happens inside your arteries. But now imagine pouring warm water mixed with gentle dissolving agents into those pipes. The dirt slowly loosens and washes out. That's how these foods work inside your body softening, loosening, and flushing plaque. The first food is pomegranate, a fruit so powerful that researchers call it natural artery cleanser. Pomegranate contains punicalogens, a rare antioxidant found nowhere else in nature in such high concentration. These compounds reduce inflammation, repair the endothelial lining, increase nitric oxide, and reverse arterial stiffness. When nitric oxide increases, your arteries relax, blood pressure drops naturally, and circulation improves. People who regularly consume pomegranate often notice easier breathing, lighter chest feeling, warmer hands and feet, and more energy. This is because their blood finally flows smoothly. The second food is walnuts. Not almonds, not peanuts, walnuts. They contain ALA, omega-3, S, L, arginine, vitamin E, plant sterols, and polyphenols, all of which work together to repair artery walls. They reduce LDL oxidation, which is the real reason cholesterol becomes dangerous. They improve endothelial function, which means smoother blood flow. They reduce inflammation markers. And they stop plaque from hardening. Walnuts are like tiny medicine capsules created by nature. And the third food is garlic. Garlic contains a powerful compound called allicin, which thins the blood, dissolves plaque, reduces cholesterol, and improves overall circulation. Aged garlic extract has even shown clinical ability to reduce soft plaque inside arteries. Garlic works like a cleaning brush inside your blood vessels. When people add garlic to their routine, they often feel improved warmth in their chest, smoother breathing, and less heaviness in the body. But I want to go deeper. You deserve to know the emotional and mental impact of artery healing as well. Poor circulation doesn't only damage the body, it damages your mind. 
When your brain doesn't get enough oxygen, you experience irritability, fatigue, sadness, brain fog, and loss of motivation. Many people think they are depressed when actually they just have low circulation. As your arteries heal, your mood improves, your memory sharpens, and your motivation rises. Your body feels alive again. But here's a mistake many people make. They add healthy foods, but continue on healthy habits that silently damage arteries daily, stress, poor sleep, dehydration, long sitting hours, processed foods, and late night meals. These habits create inflammation. They stress the heart. They thicken the blood. They stiffen the arteries. If you want true healing, both things are needed. Feeding the body with artery, repair foods, and avoiding daily habits that destroy arteries. The good news is you don't need a strict lifestyle change. Small changes repeated daily produce bigger results than extreme changes followed for a week. A add pomegranate, add walnuts, add garlic, drink more water, sleep earlier, walk 10 minutes after meals. These simple steps produce powerful results inside your arteries. Now let's continue because understanding your arteries is one thing, healing them is another. People often ask, if arteries can repair, why doesn't everyone naturally heal? The answer lies in the daily imbalance between damage and repair. Every single day, your arteries experience microscopic damage from stress, poor sleep, high blood sugar, dehydration, trans fats, and emotional pressure. These micro tears are tiny, invisible, silent, but your body is constantly trying to repair them. The problem is that for many people, the damage happens faster than the repair. Imagine someone trying to clean a house while another person throws dust every minute. No matter how fast they clean, the house will remain dirty unless the dust stops. That's exactly what happens inside you. Your body wants to heal, but your lifestyle keeps creating interruptions. This is why adding natural artery repair foods makes such a huge difference. They strengthen your repair system so it can finally work faster than the damage. To understand how powerful this can be, let's go inside your arteries for a moment. Deep inside the arterial wall lies the endothelium. the thin delicate inner lining that controls blood flow, pressure, and flexibility. When this lining gets damaged, everything changes. Blood flow becomes rough instead of smooth. Plaque starts sticking. Inflammation increases. But when the endothelium heals, your arteries become flexible, smooth, and open again. Blood flows like a river, not like a block drain. Natural foods like pomegranate, walnuts, and garlic support this endothelial healing. They don't act like medicine, they act like fuel medicine manages a symptom. But these foods nourish your repair system. They feed the cells that rebuild the artery wall. They reduce oxidative stress, which is one of the biggest reasons plaque forms. They improve nitric oxide production, which is your artery's natural relaxation signal. When nitric oxide rises, your arteries open naturally. No pressure, no stiffness, no strain. But healing doesn't only happen inside your arteries, it, it also happens inside your mind. When blood flows better, your brain gets more oxygen. The fog lifts. Your thoughts feel clearer. You feel more emotionally balanced. You think faster, react better, and your stress tolerance improves. Many people don't realize that poor circulation is one of the hidden causes behind mood swings, tiredness, and low motivation. When your blood flow improves, you don't just heal physically, you heal mentally. There's something else people rarely talk about, the connection between artery health and energy. When your circulation is poor, every organ works harder. Your muscles fatigue quickly. Your brain tires easily. Your heart beats faster to push blood through narrow pathways. That's why people with clogged arteries often feel exhausted, even after simple tasks. But when circulation improves, everything changes. Your energy rises, your breathing feels lighter, your body moves with ease. You don't wake up tired, you wake up ready. Now let's talk about how these artery healing foods work together. Pomegranate reduces inflammation and boosts nitric oxide. Walnuts reduce LDL oxidation and support endothelial repair. Garlic helps maintain healthy blood flow and supports cleansing of soft plaque. Together, they create a gentle but powerful daily repair cycle inside your arteries. These foods don't work like magic, they work like nature. Slow, steady, real. And that's what makes them so effective. But adding foods alone is not enough. You must also remove the daily habits that damage arteries. These habits include long sitting stress, smoking, processed oils, sugary foods, and lack of sleep. If you want real healing, you need balance, repair, and prevention. For example, something as simple as walking 10 minutes after 
Every meal can dramatically improve your circulation. Drinking enough water keeps your blood from becoming too thick. Getting proper sleep reduces inflammation levels. Eating on time stabilizes your blood sugar. Small habits can create a big difference. Think of your arteries like roads. If the roads are cracked and broken, traffic slows down. Accidents happen. Vehicles pile up. But if the roads are smooth, wide, and clean, traffic moves effortlessly. Your blood works the same way. When your arteries are healthy, your heart doesn't need to overwork. Your blood pressure stays stable. Your oxygen levels stay balanced. Every cell in your body gets what it needs on time. Healing your arteries transforms your entire body, not just your heart. Now I want you to imagine the next few weeks of your life. Imagine adding a small bowl of pomegranate to your morning. Imagine eating a handful of walnuts in the afternoon. Imagine adding garlic to your dinner. These small steps begin to shift your inner chemistry. Some people notice changes in the first week, lighter breathing, warmer hands and feet, improved digestion, better sleep. Some notice mental clarity returning. Some feel a new kind of energy, a calm, steady, natural energy that comes from improved circulation. You don't need to change your entire life. You don't need to follow a complicated diet. You don't need expensive supplements. Your body already knows how to heal. It simply needs the right support. Your arteries are not doomed. Your heart is not weak. Your body is not against you. It wants to heal. It has always wanted to heal. You just have to give it what it needs to do its job. Healing is not a one-time event. It is a daily choice. Every bite you take either helps your arteries or hurts them. Every habit either repairs or damages. Every moment you choose matters. You don't need perfection. You need consistency. One pomegranate a day, a handful of walnuts, a little garlic. Better sleep, more water, a short walk. These decisions add up. They create a healing environment inside your body. Let me tell you something else. When your arteries begin to heal, it doesn't just improve your body, it improves your confidence. You feel strong. You feel capable. You trust your body again. You start making better choices naturally. Healing brings a sense of control that many people lose when they face health issues. It reminds you that your body is not a burden, it's a miracle. So as you move forward, remember this, your artery health is not decided by your age, your past, or your genetics. It is shaped by your habits. It is influenced by the foods you choose. It responds to the way you treat your body. And no matter where you are today, you can begin healing right now. Start small, stay consistent, nourish your arteries, support your circulation, reduce the habits that cause damage, and let your body do the rest. Your healing doesn't begin in hospitals or with complicated treatments. It begins in your kitchen with your choices, with your commitment to yourself. You are not too late. You are not too old. You are not too damaged. Your arteries can support you. Your heart can strengthen. Your circulation can improve. And your body can repair itself one day at a time. This journey is yours. And it starts with the next bite.